Okay, this little cutie came in this morning on emergency. Well, every vet on the coast is closed because of cold, inclement, snowy, nasty weather. Uh, we decided to stay open, and of course, we get to see all the, the strange cases. Anyway, this guy's got some pain medications on board, but unfortunately, it's hard to decrease bone pain completely. But uh, we're going to go ahead and splint his leg. He has a tibial fracture right there. And we're going to go ahead and splint him up and take care of him. Grandma elbowed him off the couch. Oh. Did an elbow drop. Knocked him out. Yeah. TKO. Yeah. Tibia knocked out. <laughs> Ping! Ping! <laughs> anyway... You'll probably see some pictures of this cutie and splints and stuff in just a few minutes. But for now, I'm just trying to do my, my small animal hero chant. Everybody, chant for me. Chant for you, chant for you, chant for you. Okay, how about for the puppy? Will that be better? Chant for the puppy, <laughs> chant for the puppy. All right, here we are, like 10, 15 minutes later. All the stress. Look at that sad face. That's a sad face. Oh, no. What will we do? Anyway, this guy's going to be in this splint. Splint needs to be changed every week. This guy will be on some antibiotics and some pain medications. And hopefully this leg, which is fractured about right there, will be uh, healed within about uh, four to six weeks, if not sooner. Okay, later. All right, here's a little broke leg puppy. And for a recheck and a bandage change, I want you to notice how the e-collar is missing off this guy. He's a little bit painful, so he was trying to bite us. We got a muzzle on him. Um, anyway, but uh, yes, this is not how you want our splints to come back. Oh, bad, bad client. Anyway. What? 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 You want to bite the phone? Huh? You vicious creature? Are you a vicious creature? You are a vicious creature. Yes, you are. <laughs> All right, so get a bandage change and uh, see how we are as far as uh, his healing goes.